Hello everyone, this is King Kong LT. Last video, we have told you how to use this Google Home to for voice controlling our relay controller and for the power distribution box for the output. In this video, I will show you how to use Alexa for voice control. You can use Alexa application and you can use the voice country for the speak. Okay, let's begin how to do with it. Uh, we can see uh, this is six step. Uh, it's also very easy. Uh, before we have used the node red and running the Raspberry Pi, and also we have used the Google Home, the node red node. And this time we will use the node red for Amazon Alexa. And you can use Amazon Alexa and the Google Home at the same time, uh, if you just you want. And the first, you can see the step, uh, we can register uh, this platform. Just use this URL and copy to your web browser, and you will find this web page. This is the Node-RED Alexa Home Skill Bridge. Uh, so we can install this one and register the first step. And you can register, and because I have already registered, I just log in. Log in with the username and the password. And now you can create a output uh, such as this is release 3 uh, because release 1 and release 2 we have used for the google home and we use release 3 for a test just a switch so we can add a device and the name we can choose the bedroom light uh, just uh, according to your needs and this action will be on and off because this is a switch we can turn on the relay and turn off the relay just a light and this is the application type, we can choose the switch and we can press OK and then you will see this icon, this is icon action for the bedroom light and this account uh, for this Amazon Alexa Home Skill Bridge and will update the state uh, for the node red so that we can use the uh, Amazon Alexa to voice country the relay output so we, we have done the step one, uh, so it's very easy. Done the step one, uh, just register, uh, input your username and the password. And then the second is create the device on the skill web page. Just this step, we have created the light. Uh, because you have, if you have uh, channel three or channel four or channel five, you just add a device, add a device, add a device. Uh, you can create many devices. And the third, uh, we can add the Alexa, Alexa skill on the node red. So we can go to the node red web page and we can click as a manage and uh, install and we can input Alexa. And uh, you will find uh, this skill we have used the node red country and the Alexa home skill. We just install and we can install online. Okay, now you can see this is install complete and we can choose close and now you will see the left window and you will find uh, this is Alexa node we just try out uh, this node this Amazon output just like the Google Home output also when you turn on the switch uh, it will be output true and false so we can see the next step uh, is just add this node on the node red so we just add this node and now we can add a skill the node red on your Amazon Alexa application for the node red and before you uh, set by your mobile phone you just double click and you can see uh, this edit and the input a username and the password this username and the password is this bridge a username and the password uh, this is my username is King Kony. And the password and you can press add and down deploy and you can see uh, this is connected uh, so this is use node red have connected the skill bridge uh, successfully and now we can use your mobile phone we can see the next step is add the skill of node red on your Amazon Alexa we just open the Amazon Alexa application and uh, we can go to this mall and the skill and the games and uh, just search i press this and press node red 
because I have connected with the Japanese server. So this is the Japanese word. I just press this node red. The first one, this is a node red. Uh, you can press this and just uh, for your set uh, for this uh, add the node skill because I have already added. So you will find you will find your skill. Uh, this is already exist. So this is the node red. So now you can just discover the device. Uh, we can add and uh, add the device and uh, choose other. And discover device. So not just wait uh, for about uh, 45 seconds. As uh, you can see, the Amazon is become blue. It is search for the device. This just wait to uh, for the searching result. And you can see find the file device because I have create other uh, device information. We can just you can find uh, this bedroom device. I uh, is just add by the node red. So you can choose this one and set up a device and skip and not uh, add the group and this is you can set to use and continue and we can back to the home and the device and the all device you will find uh, this is a bedroom light so we can turn on and off uh, by the Amasa application I also can press a uh, debug and connect with this line and deploy and we enable the debug window and clear you can see I can press on and this is output that is true and I press off uh, this output is false so this is a thing as a Google Home we can just copy this switch and the function uh, with the, from the Google Home diagram and we can delete uh, this debug and select this three node and uh, paste at here and uh, connect this line also we can double click uh, this is true and force the judgment and uh, this function we just need to change to relay three down and this also is three this is for off and this is for on this we have de explained details uh, on last video. We can let this line connect with this MQTT output. And now we can deploy. Then we can use the mobile phone again. We can like this. Uh, turn on. You can see this is release 3 is on. Release 3 is on. And I can also turn off. Uh, this release 3 is off. And also, I can use this speak. Use this Amazon speak. Alexa, turn on bedroom light. As you can see, the bedroom light is released. Really. Now it's on. Alexa, turn off bedroom light. As you can see, this is voice country by Alexa. So you can create uh, many notes uh, like the first the fifth uh, this is alexa you just uh, try out uh, this node uh, at this way at this way so you can create uh, many nodes for different channel output so this is how to use the alexa speak and the alexa application uh, to control your output okay thanks for watching